Good afternoon, it's Steve Crocker and it's time for this week's Jazz Lee's Lockdown Show. Today we've got another lovely selection of music featuring recorded performances at our Jazz Leeds venues by singers Ian Shaw and Kate Peters, by pianists Dan Wielden and Paul Edis, and by sax stars Jesse Bannister, Dan Shout and Ben Clatworthy. But to start, Danish jazz singer Mads Mathias at Seven Arts in 2016 with Tea for Two. Picture me upon your knee, a tea for two, two for tea. Me for you, you for me alone. Well, there's nobody near us to see us, hear us. Friends or relations on weekend vacations. What would it be known that we own a telephone? Yeah. Now spring will break and you'll awake. Start to bake the sugar cake for me to take for all the guys to see. We could raise a family, a boy for you and a girl for me. Or can't you see how happy we could be? Little, 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 little
Dynamic Dane, Mads Mathias on vocals, with Peter Rossendale on piano, Morton Ankerfeld on bass, plus Chapel Allerton's finest Steve Hanley on drums, from February 2016. Next up we have Newcastle pianist, composer and festival organiser Paul Edis. Paul runs a brilliant septet, who played for us at Seven Arts in 2014. This is one of his catchy compositions, Angular. Thank you. 
That's Paul Edis on piano, Graham Hardy on trumpet, Graham Wilson on tenor sax, Ellie Smith on trombone, Andy Champion on the bass and Adam Sinclair on drums. Paul has contributed so much to the northern jazz scene. He's recently moved to London, so good luck and hopefully more success for him there. The next recording is of Leeds-based Indo-jazz saxophone supremo Jesse Bannister. Jesse mixes his fierce Hindustani-inspired melodies with the harmonic depths of jazz. And what a lovely quartet he brought to us in Leeds, too, with Zoe Rahman on piano, Eddie Hick on the drums, and Leeds legend Kenny Higgins on bass. The band is called Play Out, and this particular track is The Pearl.
That's Jesse Bannister's lovely band Play Out with the tune The Pearl, written about uh, a poem by Khalil Gilbram. They played in November 2014. Now, a frequent visitor to the UK is Los Angeles based sax player Ben Clatworthy. He's a melodic, swinging sax player, but he can also turn his hand to Coltrane esque jazz ballads like this one, For Heaven's Sake.
Yeah, that was lovely, wasn't it? Ben Clackworthy on sax, New York piano player Cecilia Coleman, Simon Thorpe on the bass and Matt Home on drums. 25th of October, 2018 at Seven Arts. Now it's always good to hear a song from this next artist. Are there arriving songs of love? I'll <laughs> from me. I'll a lucky star arms of love, but not for me. With the love to lead the way, I find more skies of grey than any Russian play could guarantee. Ooh, 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 ooh
Singer Ian Shaw with piano player Barry Green, an impromptu version of It's Not For Me at Seven Arts in 2016. The next two tunes both feature talented Manchester-based pianist Dan Wielden. The first is his trio with Gavin Barris on bass and drummer Caroline Bowden. That's one of his tunes, Toma Franga. Then we hear him accompanying South African saxman Dan Shout at Inkwell with Barracks 44.
been listening to uh, Dan Shout, South African sax man, who's a frequent visitor to Leeds and a very popular player as well. Dave Walsh was on drums, Dan Wielden on piano, Gavin Barris on the double bass. Hope you're enjoying the show so far. We've got one tune to go, but before that we'll do this week's Jazz Raffle. The question for all of you pub fans as well as jazz fans, our Leeds Inkwell venue used to be called something else. What was its name when it used to be a pub? That's the question this week. What was the former name of the Leeds Inkwell venue? Answers to me, Steve Crocker, that's info at jazzleeds.org.uk or respond via social media. And you could be this week's Big Cheese if you get the right answer. So we finished today with popular Leeds-based jazz singer Kate Peters and her big band, heard at our Christmas party last year, singing Count Basie's classic, Shiny Stockings. No Jazz Unlock show next week, as we're back at Seven Arts for some live music on Sunday the 5th of July in their open-air courtyard. We've got the Lees Jazz Trio helping them out in their launch event. Hope you can join us, and let's hope the weather is kind as well. It'll start at around about 1.30. So, this could be our final lockdown jazz show then? Maybe. That depends on the virus, I guess, and the weather. You can't guarantee outdoor gigs, can you? Not in Leeds, anyway. But this is Steve Crocker. Hope you, you can enjoy the rest of your weekend, and I'll maybe actually see you in the flesh next weekend. Bye. <laughs> I have to find a new, a new